who is also my predecessor. Having been a chair of NEC Council from 2016 and having steered NEC back to the right direction and now the CES Ministry of Education as well as as a council we have gained much. NEC Council under my leadership is indeed committed to maintaining the standards set by set to ensure effective management and administration of the national examinations. Gains made during examination administration in 2019. The following are just but a few of the highlights of the gains made in 2019. Registration of candidates. In 2019, NEC undertook registration in one and a half months, which was an improvement from the previous years. This was as a result of enhanced infrastructure and logistical systems. In 2019, NEC also introduced a new system of confirming candidates' registration details through SMS. This enabled parents and guardians to verify their candidates' registration details, which in turn enhanced efficiency in processing of examination results. Enhanced surveillance. In 2019, NENC maintained and ensured continual improvement in handling of examination materials both during the internal processes as well as during the field administration. This was done through enhanced monitoring of examinations and collaboration with the government security agencies. The Ministry of Education has especially continued working closely with the Ministry of Interior and, Co and the Coordination of National Government to ensure that the facilitation for security is assured throughout the period of national examinations. This aided in the elimination of examination cheating cartels and the consequent reduction of cases of cheating in examinations to a bare minimum. In increase in number of examiners. In 2019, NEC trained more examiners to enhance effectiveness and in the process and reduce the time taken to mark English composition and the Swahili initial continued collaboration with the stakeholders. NEC continues to recognize the critical role played by all education-related stakeholders and has worked with them in close consultations throughout the year. As a council, we continue to appeal to all stakeholders, including students, parents, teachers, unions, associations, media, and general public to marshal support in stemming out attempted examination malpractices. In conclusion, on behalf of the NEC Council, I hereby wish to assure Kenyans that NEC shall endeavor to offer credible examinations so as to offer certification which is recognized, valid, and reliable. With those remarks, I now wish to invite the PS, Dr. Belio Kipsang, the Principal Secretary, State Department of Education, Ministry of Education, to make his remarks and in turn invite the CEO or you have the COFAS. Okay. Madam. So, 
May I take this opportunity to invite the CEO, Kenya National Examination Council, to continue with the program. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen.